Hello Taurus and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a great day today. So let's see what's going on around you in love, what spirit wants you to know. Just take what resonates, leave the rest behind. Okay, so um, there's a masculine and a karmic that are in a face-off. They're doing this in public, okay? So this could be at a restaurant, this could be at a grocery store, it could be in a convenience store parking lot, I don't know. Um, it could even be at a family event. So this could be something that's coming up around, like, for the Christmas holidays, you know. Um, it could definitely be at a family event. And I feel like people are kind of standing back. They're kind of like, whoa, if you look at these people, they get behind a table and everything. And they're looking at this going, somebody's going to pop off on each other here. I feel it's a family event, and nobody wants to get involved. They just kind of watch, like in amazement. What is this all about? And this doesn't have to be, like, this could be a, a family event that's being held, like, I'm seeing food, maybe even a tent, I don't know. I'm seeing, um, like, a Christmas celebration, but it doesn't have to be on Christmas. Yeah, see, this this karmic's going to completely embarrass themselves in public at this event. Um, and both of these people, I feel, it's they are going to be embarrassed by this. But this is, it feels to me like the masculine kind of wanted this to go down this way. Okay? Yeah, I feel like the, the karmic is going to be like, what can I do? What can I do to fix this, right? What can I do to make people believe that I'm an angel? I feel like she's trying to get people to believe that she's a sweetheart, that she would never, like, go off on somebody, but she does it right And Look, she pops off in front of everybody, okay? And she has no idea how to make people see her um, the way they used to anymore, and this is to get, I feel like your person was being led to do something to get out of the situation. And this is it. This, I feel like, was a plan. Okay? I, f I feel like it was planned out. I'm being led to look at the floor and all of this. It's almost like a game board. Okay? Um, yep, and it just feels like checkmate. Like, she, this, this masculine has... I feel like they start a fight or they aggravate this karmic in a public setting so that everyone they know can see them for what they really are. Because this masculine knows that she can't contain her anger. She can't, she's got no anger management at all. She just pops off. They wanted to see what goes on behind closed doors. Okay? And this karmic is going to expose herself as kind of going nutty. Like at the drop of a hat. Like all of a sudden she just starts screaming and fighting at this event. People are literally taking a step back. Like backing away like whoa. Okay. But she tried to get people to believe that she was a divine being or a divine feminine. Or um, their perfect soulmate. She wanted people to believe that she was perfect but she wasn't. It was fake. Okay. And now um, everybody else is seeing it now. They're all going to see her for who they are. And I feel like this is this is how your masculine is going to get out of the situation. Yeah. Um, everybody is going to be able to witness this. Okay. They're going to see the evidence that she's fake. And, um, and there's, there may even be some kind of mental instability with this card, as I say that. This is the mental instability card and the inability to hold back the rage, okay? She, like, goes off at this event, you guys. The family members in the background are, like, in shock, People are going to be shocked by what this karmic does at this event, okay? For real. They're never going to say, they're witnessing this. Somebody could be taking pictures as well while this is happening, or uh, it could be on video. 
<laughs> They're taking a home video of this event. Okay, but that's what it feels like. Like, document this, man. You know what I mean? This masculine, he, this masculine could have been getting some kind of, like, um, like abuse going on in the background as well. This is, they've, I feel like they've tried to tell people they feel trapped and stuck there. They're afraid of this karmic. That if there's children involved, the children are afraid of this karmic. And I feel like everybody had a hard time believing him until they see this. Now the family is like, whoa, okay. What the heck just happened to the karmic? She's lost her mind. Yeah, that's what they're going to be saying. She may blame it on like, oh, I might be pregnant and my hormones are going crazy. Or she could have recently, she could be so... um burdened by anger and rage that she could actually end up having some kind of miscarriage here okay she could have even if she's had a miscarriage she blamed this masculine and now this masculine they're getting their vindication though behind the scenes okay they are i feel like I, everybody is thinking why didn't you just choose divine feminine in the first place what are you doing Okay, here you are standing strong. You're in both emperor and empress energy here. It's absolutely beautiful. This is probably the best card in this deck. Okay, you're, you're independent. You could be single right now, but you don't need anyone. You're abundant. You're successful. You're strong. You're smart. And you're making bold moves for yourself. You're like, I, and here's the thing, you're not a part of this situation at all, but I feel like people are going to be bringing you up at this event after they see this karmic pop off the way she does. Yeah, see, they're going to be, there's people in this person's family that are going to be telling them to contact you, okay? Here you are in this Two of Cups energy, soulmate energy. You could be on vacation. You could be um, maybe meeting new people, taking good care of yourself, maybe um, kind of just pampering yourself here. You're looking good. You could be spending a lot of time outside by the pool, near a body of water. And I feel like there's, there's family members of this masculine's that are going to be telling them they need to reach out to you. This masculine is also going to be watching you a lot on the internet, okay? A lot. Whatever it is you're posting. Any pictures they're going to be seeing, they're going to be triggered by that. Um, yeah, I just saw that puppet. <laughs> they're going to be triggered by that. All right, so, yeah, and it's going to make them mad. Look, they're watching you like a hawk. This person, they're going to be wondering who you're entertaining. Who are you spending your time with, right? What are you going to be doing on the holidays? If you're posting pictures, like if you're on a vacation, they're going to be watching everything. If you're not on a vacation, they're going to be driving past your house, driving past your work, trying to get as much information on you as they can. They may even have somebody... All of a sudden, I just got kind of the chills here. They could very well hire somebody to kind of follow you around and take pictures of you. Did they hire a private investigator? Because that's kind of what it's looking like here now. I feel like they may have hired some kind of private investigator or hired somebody. They could have paid a friend or one of these family members right to go and follow you see what you're doing follow you on social media take pictures you gotta be kidding and i feel like whoever they hired to do this wants you too <laughs> whoever they hired to do this a friend or fa i feel like it's a friend or a family member that person's going to want to date you as well. Oh my gosh. 
they're finding out that you've got new options coming to you. Everybody's attracted to you in this energy. You have to understand, you know, your strength, your courage, your confidence, um, the fact that you're in both masculine and feminine energy, your independence, you know, all of that is so attractive to other people. Um, you're literally attracting new things to you, new people to you, like a magnet. Okay? And, um, yeah, whoever they hired, I feel like they paid somebody, a family member, to, ta to like take photos of you, follow you around, stalk you, right? And come back with any information they could find. Well, in doing this, I feel like whoever they hired, is um, they're going to want to date you as well. Somebody else's too. Yeah, look, and it's somebody that they know. It's somebody that they're going to end up having to compete with. It's it's a friend or a close family member. Look at the way they're they're balling up their fists, ready to fight with each other over you. I'm telling you, people are going to start fighting over you, collective. Okay, they are, and this karmic knows it. Um. I feel like your masculine is escaping from the karmic. They're breaking away. Um, she's exposing herself to everybody else. And um, they're going to want to come in and date you, okay? Everybody is. Everybody, yeah, they're all getting ready for it now. <laughs> yeah, they're all getting prepared, shaving, showering, right? Maybe changing their shirt. Okay, yeah, look at you. You're out here attracting attention to yourself. Um, this, I feel like the karmic is going to be asking your person for money, okay? Because of children, there could be children involved, something like that. She's not going to stop wanting things from your person, whether it's help, money. She's going to be pulling on their heartstrings, okay? Okay. But look at how everybody's watching you. You're, you're the world. You're literally everything. And whatever you're doing online, too, you're attracting a lot of attention to yourself. Here's, there it is. You're glowing. So all of these, there's like possibly three options. Your person from your past. A new person that, um, this is somebody brand new, right, that you may be getting to know soon and whoever this masculine's friend is or family member that's coming in to to um stalk you right look at look your masculine is like oh f right what is going on what is happening that's <laughs> that's the energy i'm getting what is happening here you know all of a sudden everybody wants my empress, what the heck am I going to do? Meanwhile, you're online. You could be um, dating online as well. If they're finding this out, they're like, oh my gosh. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to lose my, my divine feminine. I'm going to lose her to someone new. They're going to have to compete. They are. They're going to have to compete and fight for your love, man. I'm telling you. Yeah, because you've got a lineup. I just saw my It's Raining Men card, okay? <laughs> yeah, if it comes out again, I'll pull it out. But, um, <laughs> yeah, you're just, you're out here in this beautiful Empress in the Minor Arcana energy, focused on you, being all kinds of chill, um, down to earth. People love your energy. They love being around you right now. Okay, you inspire others. You make people feel good. All right, you're attracting a lot of people. Yeah, and this masculine is upset because they're seeing this soulmate connection coming to an end here. Okay, um, they could also be maybe even getting in some kind of car accident. It could even be something like drinking and driving, okay? Or that could be this karmic. Somebody's a, somebody is about to get into a drinking and driving accident. 
possibly coming from this um, family celebration, okay? All right, what else can you show me? I feel like it's the karmic, maybe. Give me one more for my beautiful collective. Yeah, everybody's watching you. Everybody wants you. Your person, their friend or family member, they're both going to want you. You're already out here meeting new people. I'm telling you, it's going to drive this person berserk. It's going to drive them berserk. Okay? Um, let's, let's see what they want to say to you. I want to know what they want to say. What does this person want to say to my beautiful collective? Just get ready um, for all of these dates. Everybody's going to wait. You need to buy a calendar, okay? <laughs> you need to get it like a day planner or something, some kind of schedule book. Because I'm telling you, everybody is going to want a chance with this empress, okay? You may already notice everybody like wanting to talk to you and stuff. It was weird. I went to a Panera yesterday and there's this man there who was staring at me, watching me eat the whole time. I can't stand that. But um, when I was getting up to leave, he like kind of stopped me and he just started talking to me and he was actually really super nice. And we had a nice little conversation like you're going to start to notice People wanting to be around you. People wanting to talk to you. You're interesting and they're interested and they want to know more. Okay? So just be aware, right? I feel so guilty about my actions and what I said to you. I miss our conversations and the sound of your voice. I hope the future will bring us together. I wish you, could, I wish you would knock on my door. Yeah, this person just wants you to go to them, but that's not happening. The Empress doesn't chase. There is no one else thinking about you all day. I'm putting myself first right now. So this is your person, finally, I feel, breaking free from the karmic. Okay, standing up for themselves. I remember how we used to laugh and talk for hours about everything. I'm sorry about that, Collective. Okay, just a couple more. I know what you mean to me. I'm ready to be with only you now. But you have other options now, Collective. Please give me a second chance. This person, they, they may need to beg. They're going to have to compete with others. They're going to have to really fight for this. And honestly, if this person already hurt you, there's a good chance that you don't trust them already. So, you know, just... Take it how it resonates with you, but yeah, um, you're attracting so much attention to you right now. <laughs> just get ready for your dating life to just kind of come alive all of a sudden, okay? 